Hello YouTube, it's the Brick Adjuster here with another LEGO Monthly Room Tour for the month of November 2016. New this month, we have the Beatles Yellow Submarine, we have the Spider-Man U-Bridge, and we have a new Nexo Knight scene. So here we go, enjoy! New this month, we have the Beatles Yellow Submarine up here with all my LEGO idea sets. Not all of them are up here, but most of them are up here. I was able to make room for the yellow submarine, so now it fits. This is also new, my new Nexo Knight setup, my Nexo Knight scene. So we have a bunch of the ultimate Nexo Knights here, the regular Nexo Knights here, we have some shields, and the Fortrex. I kept the Fortrex built. And we have the U-Bridge new this month, the ugly bridge, the Spider-Man U-Bridge. So I stuck it at the back of my Spider-Man scene. It's kind of like just a back facade decoration. And it's here with, oh, this is also new. I got this from Down Under Bricks. And it is the 2004 Spider-Man. Here we have Man of Steel. I got rid of the Man, in, Man of Steel ship. Over here we have Gardens of the Galaxy with modified Groot. Over here are the X-Men. And then we got the Avengers with the Avenge Jet. And just a bunch of the Avenger minifigures just hanging out there with Ant-Man. And the Avengers Tower. Here is the UCS Helicarrier with some more minifigures in the front. We got some mosaics from Toys R Us Make and Take and Toys R Us Make and Take here with some Superman minifigures. On the back we have some Justice League minifigures in a case and some Marvel minifigures. And those are mocks there by Big T and this is a set, not a mock. Here is the UCS Batman Tumblr. And I'm reserving this space in the back here for the Lego Batman movie Arkham Asylum when I finally get that one. Maybe some of these vehicles might have to go. We'll see. And we have a bunch of Batman variants here, which will be overpopulated soon with some more Batman variants coming out with the CMF Batman line. Here are Simpsons minifigures with the Quickie Mart, the Simpsons house, and just a lot of the uh, Simpsons minifigures from the CMF line. This is my Micro Wizard of Oz mock. So just the different scenes from the Wizard of Oz. And over here we have the Heart Lake Bat Cave. And over here we have Ducky Momo and Family, which is another mock. And we have Cloud Cuckoo Land. And now all the Disney minifigures are no longer in the front there because I've added them to the Disney castle. So here is my Disney castle with a bunch of minifigures in the front. We have the mini dolls from the Disney princess. Some mini dolls over here. And then the Disney CMFs are just scattered around the top. And all of this is in front of or behind Smalley World. So I figure we'll put the Disney Castle by Smalley World because Smalley World is part of an amusement park. And here is a mock I made for Brick Tubers, which is my chicken habitat. But that's going to be taken apart soon. Over here is a portrait that one of the Brick Zappers friends made of us in our Philly Brickfest torso or Philly Brickfest t-shirts. Here is my Sig Fig bridge with all my Sig Figs on top. I'm sure you can recognize a bunch of the Sig Figs here. Maybe you can even recognize yourself on the bridge and some of the Sig Figs going into their dark ages. Here is a portrait from Dan Solo Galleries and another one of the Brick Adjuster and family. Here are some of our own Sig Figs and our Sig Figs in our Philly Brickfest torsos. Here are some awards we got from different LEGO conventions. Two plug in the back. 
And over here are the brick tubers, bricks and torsos. And some of the brick zapper sig figs. Over here is another portrait from Dan Solo Gallery of some sig figs. And we got Mount Sigmore here also from Dan Solo Galleries. Here is my Batman setup, the classic Batcave that is modified with the awesome classic Batman minifigures. Love the villains here. And over here is the Arkham Asylum with a bunch of the villains in the front. And next door is Jokerland and the Funhouse Escape. These are the architecture sets with the German soccer team up front. And some more architecture sets over here. And then some more architecture sets down here as well. A lot of them. Not sure what I'm going to do with the new ones. I'll try to find space. Here is my modified Sydney Opera House with my micro sig figs with Big Ben in the back. And we have some more micro sig figs over here. And here is a view of the modified Sydney Opera House from the front. Okay, this is Metal Beard Sea Cow, a great looking Lego movie set with Metal Beard on the back there. And over here is the expanded double decker couch. This is my micro sea cow and my micro couch with Benny Spaceship behind. Here are some more Lego movie sets. We have Emmett's Constructo Mech. We have my construction worker army in the front. We have my garbage can army in the back. And over here we have another scene from the Lego movie. We have the micromanagers chasing Wildstyle and Emmett. And then over here, all the uni kitties are up at the front. And we got Lord Business's Evil Lair in the back. And then down here, again from the Lego movie, we have all the police officers with the super secret police squad. These are my Walking Dead minifigures from Eclipse Graphics. And I stuck Craven the Hunter here as well. He kind of matches. And here is the Volkswagen camper van, the Mini Cooper, and the Mini Mini Cooper, and the Mini Camper van. Here are some more vehicles. We have the Lego Ideas Caterham 7. We have the Volkswagen Beetle. And then down here, the Ferrari, the Cool Car, and just another Lego Creator car. Here is my Spaceman army. We have the classic Spaceman, the Futuron, Blacktron, and all the other Spacemen from different eras of Lego. Canadian flag from JK Brickworks over there. And this side we have Galaxy Squad. Galaxy Squad vehicles. And we have some Exoforce. I stuck the Exoforce here. Here are my aliens, so Toy Story aliens, Stitches, um, Aqua, Atlantis, Atlantis, and then just other aliens, and then some of the Scurriers. This is another Lego idea set. It is the maze, JK Brickworks. And here is my Jurassic World setup with my dinosaurs. And I have a Jurassic World Park, or Jurassic World Mock in the back. And over here, we got Minecraft. So these are the skins that came in two packs. And then we got just a bunch of Minecraft minifigures in the front with the micro Minecraft in the back. And then down here, we have the Pirate's Chess Set. Now for the modulars, we have my expanded Parisian restaurant over here. We have the fire brigade with the fire truck mech up top. We have my expanded palace cinema where I turn a corner 
Calisthenomy into a side building. Here is the pet shop. I resisted getting another pet shop that I saw on sale. Just no room to stick stuff in. Here we have the detective's office. And we have the brick bank over here. So when the new assembly square comes, I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna have to stick it in here somehow and maybe move these guys around. This kind of looks like an assembly square in itself, so I don't know. I don't know what we're gonna do. But over here we have hot dog army, shark army, banana army, and oh, the chickens were there, but they're in the muck right now. Here is my expanded Grand Emporium and the expanded Town Hall. Two great sets with couples getting married in the front. We got the teenage mom with her triplets and a nice flower cart. This is my Ghostbusters HQ, my biggest Lego set so far in terms of pieces. We got two Ecto ones over here, the old one and the new one, and a bunch of the minifigures from the Ghostbusters movie and the original movie. Here is the Tower of Orthanc, a huge set from Lego Lord of the Rings. And beside that I have my micro Tower of Orthanc. Over here we have Smaug by the Lonely Mountain. And we have the Black Gate with all the Urukai, Urukai army. Now for more Lord of the Rings sets, we have the pirate ship, a great pirate ship, the ghost pirate ship. And this is Lake Town, some of the different sets from Lake Town. And over here we have the Fellowship of the Rings by the Rivendale set. We got Attack on Weathertop in the back. We got Gol Golgador, Golgador Attack. Merkwood Spiders. This is Bilbo Baggins' house. An expected gathering with uh, dwarves on top. We got some wargs, three wargs. I like the wargs. And over here we got the Barrel Escape with all the different elves. And lastly, we got the Goblin King, Goblin King Battle. And these are all the goblins from one of the collectible minifigure series. I can't remember now which one. But I just added them just because they are goblins. This is my Western scene. So we have the Lone Ranger sets mixed in with the Lego Movie sets here. It's a nice looking western scene that I have. The, the track and the train. And beside the western scene we have the monster fighter scene. So there's a bunch of trick or treaters here up at the front in costume. But little do they know that in the back are all the actual monsters. But we have the monster fighters here to fight off the monsters. This is the Haunted Mansion, a great set with the vampire and his wife, some zombies in the front. And then over here we have the Vampire Castle. And then this side over here we have another theme. This is Pharaoh's Quest, a nice looking pyramid. And we got a cobra and a sphinx. And as for the minifigures, these minifigures here are actually from Prince of Persia. And that's a CMF. Jaundice. And over here we have Indiana Jones minifigures. And Johnny Thunder minifigures. Those are Pharaoh's Quest minifigures. These are my Pirates of the Caribbean sets mixed in with other sets actually from the same kind of motif we have the medieval market over here we got some knights knights kingdom and a king and queen here i might add my second pirate chess set the minifigures just to populate some more pirates 
and some more soldiers just in this scene and then some more Pirates of the Caribbean sets over here here is my house that is going under renovation with all my renovators over here we have the costume guys and so I guess the orca would be the one that's coming in next maybe I'll just stick the orca beside the shark guy from the Batman series we got the different clowns here and court jesters still missing the clown with the red hair so that's from series one that's expensive here is my jock house cheerleaders with the football player and just the different athletes exercisers hockey players and baseball and then over here we have the cool kids house we got Brittany and Paris and the double mint twins in the back disco dude and dudette we got the rockers and I guess I, maybe I can stick glam Batman there he's kind of a rocker rocking it out skateboarders and we have the pizza guy here's the beach house with the surfer dude and surfer dudette in the back we have a lighthouse and sharks okay my winter village sets we have the cottage in the front we have a nice holiday train and then over here we have some rides another train and then we have some more winter village sets And this is the newest one, the holiday train. So many trains in this scene. And then this way we have the Christmas trees being sold. And lastly in the back we have the expanded Santa's village. Where I took two Santa's villages and just combined them. One big one with a combined expanded reindeer sleigh setup. Okay Ninjago! Here are the temples that I have for Lego Ninjago. These little masks were make and takes from Toys R Us. And here is the Temple of Air Jitsu, a great looking Lego set. And my micro Temple of Air Jitsu with some Lego dimensions. Here is my outdoor scene. I got a log cabin over here. I got a mountain hut or two mountain huts. Two alternate builds combined. And that's from the Lego movie. Here is my Hogwarts scene. Bunch of the Hogwarts minifigures. I just checked and this la lady here, Professor Umbridge, is expensive now. 130 Canadian. Crazy. I didn't get her for one. But things are just going up and up and up. But these are a bunch of Hogwarts minifigures in the, I think it's 2010, 2010 or 2011 Hogwarts castle. Okay, more mocks. This is my micro Ghostbuster mock. This is my modification to the Lego Ideas Big Bang Theory. I just added the kitchen and the computer area. Over here we have my Justice League micro mock, my Portal 2 micro mock, and my Doctor Who micro mock. Then we got Scooby-Doo over here. We got Back to the Future. And we got The Simpsons. Which I still gotta take this dinosaur thing apart. But no rush I guess. Here is my Angry Birds scene. And I have another Angry Birds set that I don't know if it's gonna fit now after building it. The castle, the pig's castle. We'll see. Okay, Star Wars time. This is my favorite Lego set of all time, the Ewok Village. Great looking Lego set that it's huge. Well, it's expanded. Here is my Stormtrooper army. I got a Wookiee gunship in the back. ATST? I don't know. Now we have, this is from Endor. That's an Endor set. And there's another walking figure over there. Down here we have the UCS Sandcrawler with some astromech droids, some Jawas, some more droids, and a Dubak. This is 
Most Eyes Cantina with a Land Speeder and an MPT. And then down here we have Jabba's Palace with the Rancor Pit underneath. That Rancor's cool. Jabba's cool too. Both of them are cool. Some more minifigures over here. And there. And over here we have Jabba's Sail Barge. I like this set as well. This is a mock. It's a micro scene from The Force Awakens uh, at the beginning of the movie. We have some pirates and bounty hunters. And the Sarlacc Pit. Here is my clone trooper army with my grandpa clone troopers in the front. We got Captain Rex, Commander Wolf, and Commander Gregor. We got the Genosian warriors over here as well. And some battle droids and super battle droids. This is my Hoth scene, not the UCS Hoth set, but just different Hoth sets combined to make a Hoth scene. And over here is my Force Awakens scene. Just some sets and minifigures from the movie, The Force Awakens. This is a micro mock I made from one of the scenes from The Force Awakens. And this one as well, spoiler alert. Don't look at that because it might spoil the movie for you. Here are some ships from Star Wars, a Y-Wing, an A-Wing. Here is my 2008 Death Star, not the new one, the old one with the old minifigures. Some pilots in the front. And over here we have some Star Wars ships. The bigger Star Wars ships actually. I like the big Star Wars ships. And coming this way we have some more bigger Star Wars ships. Some pod racers. And then down here, we got some more, eh, somewhat big, X-Wing, Millennium Falcons, the Ghost, Slave 1, ATT, I'm not sure. Here is my Sith Army. And there is a new addition to the Sith Army, this guy. The fifth brother, Inquisitor, Inquisitor fifth brother. He's new, he's new to the group. And then over here we have my Jedi, the Jedi army with all the lightsabers. And then up here we have my UCS B-Wing, some minifigures over here. And then we got some brick set minifigures, some brick fat Toronto minifigures, Mardi Gras man swag, and some chrome keychain. Here is my UCS R2-D2 and my at -AT with some more minifigures here. We have my Advent Calendar minifigures. So the white Chewbacca will be joining this crew for 2016. My Celebration, Star Wars Celebration figs. And just some protocol droids that are chrome and a chrome Stormtrooper. And up here we have the UCS Superstar Destroyer, which is this guy right here. A lot of gray. And we got the UCS Imperial Shuttle and the UCS Slave One with some more minifigures down here. Here is my Scooby-Doo scene. So these are the different Scooby-Doo sets that came out. I think all but one. I didn't really put the um, airplane set here. We got all the bad guys in their masks. Well, they're unveiled actually. And then up here we have another Harry Potter set. We got Jeffrey the Giraffe. We got Tim Tam the Duplo Whale. And the Horizon Express. Here are my Ninjago minifigures. A bunch of different variants. I just ordered on Bricklink some of the Ninjago Skybound minifigures. So those are going to be joining that group. And then over here we have Toy Story. And some more Toy Story over here. And some more Toy Story over here. And here are some Spongebob with some Simpsons behind. And some more Spongebob over here. Spongebob and Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, keychains and figures. 
I have some more minifigures up here. So this is Marvel. Over here we have DC. And behind here we have some more Marvel. Captain America, Iron Man, and the bunch. And of course we have Chima. Can't forget the Chima. This is my army of Chima minifigures, the different tribes. And there's a lot of them. I don't have all of them, but I do have a lot. Chima. Chima lives. Chima lives in my basement. So this concludes this LEGO room tour for the month of November 2016. This is the Brick Adjuster signing off. Thanks for watching and we will see you guys in another video. Bye.